How many languages can you identify from this slide? One, two, or maybe even all of it. Who knows you might be a genius? I mean, at least we can figure out which ones in English, right? Considering the fact that only about 20% of Americans are bilingual, and then the United States has only one official language, it's not strange or surprising if you can't identify more than one language from this. However, with the audience we have here today, I'm pretty sure that you can identify at least two. You see, it is shown that a younger generation of Americans is far more likely to speak a second language compared to any other age group in this case. Then what caused the younger generation to be different from the others? To know that, we first need to identify the significance of language itself. Language is interesting because it's not just words or phrases, but it's an entity that emb embodies history, heritage, and change. It's just like a living organism that evolves organically with human expansion. It's also one of the traits that differentiate human beings from other animals. Without it, you'll fail to express your ideas or feelings deliberately. Without it, human race could not have advanced as we are now. But paradoxically, language can also create barriers. As globalization accelerates every second, the importance of foreign language learning also rises. We hear about our government making policies with countries that half our nation have never heard of it. We hear about the human rights crisis that's going on on the other side of the globe. Today, a country cannot survive with closed borders and no interactions with the rest of the world. With its complex global, global interactions, language is an essential tool to foster international peace by understanding different cultures. By recognizing its significance, many countries across the world have been promoting language education, including the US, especially for the younger generations. But with all the advantages of learning a foreign language, it could certainly be awesome to become a polyglot and impress others with the perfect language skills. However, it requires a lot of time and effort to master something and language is no exception. Four years of high school language course may not be enough to make you an expert in that language. For example, I studied Chinese for at least six years, but I still can speak Chinese fluently as a native speaker. Despite the rising demand for a higher level of language skills in this globalized society, it's quite unreasonable to expect someone to master not only English, but also Korean, Chinese, or even Swahili, who knows? Who knows what language you might need to learn in the future, depending, how, depending on how your future lays out. After all, a language should just be a tool that you can rely on for communication, not a drainage of time and effort. There is a simple solution to this dilemma, to utilize technology. However, people usually think about that online translators are not the most reliable source. I do see the point, because if you just see this example, who would ever want to use this to write a commencement speech or a really important business letter? But now, the good old goofy Google Translator is going to disappear because Google has recently adopted a new technology called Neural Machine Translation, in short, NMT. This is a huge accomplishment that could potentially resolve the limitations and the barriers of the foreign language learning. Neural Machine Translation utilizes the neural network, neural, recurrent neural network. It uses internal memory to process arbitrary sequences of inputs. It overcomes the shortcomings of the conventional phrase-based translation. NMT considers an entire input of sentence as one single unit, instead of breaking the input sentences into multiple single words and phrases. As you can see, the translated sentences are a lot smoother and then more natural. Because NMT has a built-in system of end-to-end -end learning system, it enables the machine to automatically self-learn the language and become smarter over time. As I've stated, language is essential in this world. But instead of using your time and effort, why not let the machine to learn it for you? We, the homo sapiens, have evolved with new technology. If you trace back to every great landmark that has been accomplished in human history, 
there is always an outstanding invention that had never existed before, but enabled the change to happen. Just like the invention of paper helped us to prove their knowledge, and invention of automobiles let us conquer the great distance, why don't we embrace this new technology so we can truly break the barriers? Thank you.